On April the 6th, 2019, GPS may not work anymore. Hi, I'm Ashwin Droning On, and no, this isn't clickbait. It could actually be a real problem for anybody out there that has gadgets with inbuilt GPS. And of course, that includes drones. A very well-respected technical blog called The Register are reporting that on April the 6th, 2019, gadgets with inbuilt GPS may suffer from a bit of an issue. Now, you might remember the year 2000 bug, which affected lots of software and computers, unless the software could be updated. A lot of it was, and there were not as many issues actually as IT experts expected at first. However, if you've got drones or other gadgets that can't be updated and that are vulnerable to this issue, then you might have a problem and you might find that on that day or afterwards, your drone won't acquire any more satellites. What does that mean to you, you might be asking? Well, GPS is used in drone technology to let the drone know where it is. And that means if it knows where it is, it can hold its position and hover without you giving any inputs. But in addition, at any point you can press a button and it will automatically fly back to home. That feature is better known as return to home and it relies entirely on GPS. Without GPS working, none of those features will work, your drone will drift, return to home won't work, and you may end up with a flyaway. The issue relates to how devices such as drones receive the information from the satellites and interpret it. It's actually including a timestamp, which is part of how it calculates your location. Now, I'm not gonna to get too technical here, but to quote the register, basically the timestamp stores the weak number using 10 binary bits. That means the weak number can have two to the power of 10 or 1,024 integer values. Now, the first Saturday in April will mark the end of the 1,024th week. After that, the counter will spill over back to zero. The problem there is that some devices won't be able to cater for that calculation. So my advice, if you've bought a product which has a GPS inside it, that includes even DJI products, get the firmware updated because now the industry are aware of this potential issue and no doubt they're updating their firmwares as we speak. If however you've bought a cheaper budget drone which has an inbuilt GPS but no firmware updates available for it, you might have a problem and my advice is to sit that drone on the ground after that date, let it remain there and check that it does acquire satellites. Only when you're entirely confident that it has a position, fly it. If not, don't fly it because you run the risk of flyaways and return to home not working. Comment below with your thoughts on this. Give this video a thumbs up and share it because this is quite important. Click that subscribe button now. Thank you very much for watching.